Welcome to Postscript from Faithbridge Church. Here we hope to answer your questions and help you dig deeper into the message by sitting down with the teacher of the day. Hi, and welcome to Postscript. My name is Justin. I'm the worship and communications pastor at Faithbridge. I'm with Ben Stewart, who just finished preaching part two of a three-part series here at Faithbridge on Philippians. Welcome, Ben. Thank you. Thanks for being here. Good to be here. Uh, first thing first, uh, got to answer the Postscript question that came in via text. What yeah. is the red X what is stand the X for? What is the there? meaning behind that? <laughs> right. Uh, a subtle one, I'm sure. I, well, I bought it because it's the letter X. No, I just I liked the shirt. I thought it was kind of cool. We've got um, we've got friends that lead an anti-slavery movement called End It, End it Movement that features the red X, which I love. Mm-hmm. And so a lot of people assume it's one of those shirts, which I'm, I'm fine if they assume that. That'd be awesome. But I, I bought it at the store. So you're not intentionally making a statement today. <laughs> no, I'm not intentionally making a statement today. But if you want a statement, enditmovement.com is a great statement. It's as good as any. Exactly. It's great. Yeah. Okay. Uh, secondly, seriously, the sermon is, is, is really great. Hit a lot of good points. Um, you were telling me before we started recording that this is actually something that you, you feel like you could fill up a whole sermon series with. Yeah, and did, because, I mean, uh, and I alluded to it a little bit, like, it was profound for me to, and, and I don't feel like my teachers when I was young were misleading me. I think, I think there were some emphases that came back into American evangelism, uh, evangelicalism in, in the late 90s that were really good in sort of putting back forward. The, the late of, 1990s. The, yeah, 1990s, yeah. The importance of the affections. And, um, but I don't think they misled me. I think I misunderstood a lot of it, but that, that sort of, rediscovery of that of it's all over the bible that you rejoice with joy inexpressible is what first peter says about the lord and you're like that's not a thing you do like okay for the next 10 minutes i'm going to rejoice with joy inexpressible you're like no he's talking about god's changing your heart for him so those ideas were huge for me life-shaping for me and we did at breakaway do a whole series on it uh called the chief end of man that was sort of built out of uh some of the information I alluded to in the talk. So if you want to go deeper into these ideas of the, the, the role of the mind in loving God, what does it look like to love him with your mind, the role of the affections, we did a whole series on it, Chief End of Man, which is about that. So this is kind of a meta postscript where we're saying, <laughs> actually the best postscript you could do is go, so let's, let's talk about that. Yeah. In the sermon, we talked, we alluded a little bit to the Breakaway app. Tell us a little yeah. bit about that and, and how do we get that and what do we do? Yeah, we were just trying to make what we do more accessible to everybody, you know. And so we created an app that you can download on any device. Uh, that uh, as soon as you get it on your phone, iPad, whatever, you just click and you have access to all the sermons we've done at Breakaway. You've got access to the audio Bible if you want it, some different information about Breakaway. And then... Uh, you also have access to a, a new resource we created, little short 10-minute videos or so that, that aren't videos of my face. They're actually, it's me writing on the text of the Bible showing you, here's how I study the Bible. It's teaching you how to study. And uh, that's, that's probably the thing I'm most excited about right now is helping people think along with God through his word. And so uh, that's a resource that's applicable to everybody, and we hope everyone will check out. Cool. So, and right now, the Philippians is on there now. That's correct. And then, will there more? Will you be doing more in the future? Yeah, we're kind of test casing it with Philippians. So, uh, I think it's going well. You know, we just launched it. We're going to see what people think, and and if there's a need and desire, then yeah, we'll keep going. Great. Cool. Yeah. All right. So, uh, the name of that sermon series again that we should. Go chief listen. end of man. What is the chief end of man? Great. So, yeah. We'll do that. Hey. Yeah. Do that. Thanks for being here for Postscript. We'll see you next week. And thank you. We'll see you next week as well. Thanks for joining us for Postscript. Help us keep the podcast interactive by submitting your questions during the morning services. Learn more at faithbridge.org forward slash postscript.